I'm going to tell you about my trip to Mexico. This last June, I got the opportunity to go to a wedding in Cosmo with my friend and his sister. Most of it was wrapped up in family stuff, so I didn't get much time to spend actually dealing with the wedding stuff. I spent most of my time with my friend and the maid of honor. Her name was Alyssa. We actually stayed in Playa del Carmen, and we took a ferry to Cosmo for the day. Um, it was kind of cloudy, so we weren't really wearing much clothing. We didn't wear sunscreen. The ferry ride was about 45 minutes, and by the time we got to Cosmo and off the ferry, my friend Sky was already blistered all over the top of his head. So we get off the ferry, and there's a little walkway you have to go to, and then there's a big setup of all the shops. There's this, we thought it was a scarecrow. It was this thing on a box, and it was a big brown tarp. And we get closer, and there's birds just circling it, whatever it is. We get closer, and it's this crazy witch lady, like, covered in mud from head to toe. And she opens her flaps, and all these birds fly out. And so we keep walking. We're trying to find sunscreen for Sky. Nobody sells sunscreen. So we go to our, uh, we went to rent a car to drive around the island for the day. And we get there, <coughs> they don't have our car ready. We see all these Jeeps, we see scooters, we see all this stuff. So we're thinking we're going to get a Jeep, like a brand new Jeep to drive around in. About 45 minutes later, they pull up with this mm -hmm. like, 1967 Volkswagen car. <laughs> it's covered in rust. We get in, and the seats are basically chairs like this that are bolted to the bottom of the floor. And there's only two seats in the front, and there's no seat in the back. It's just empty space on the truck. And so there's three of us. So I let them run in front, and I just sit in the back, crisscross applesauce, hoping that I don't die on the way to where, to where we're going. Um, we went to a bar called Bob Marley's. It's a beachfront bar. Um, and on the way there, it's just a stretch of highway that gets you all the way there. Um, and on the way, our my friend Sky is driving. He starts panicking. The car starts slowing down. I thought the engine failed or something. He starts freaking out. He's like, I don't know where the gas pedal is. I don't know where the gas pedal is. And he reaches down and picks up the gas pedal. And it fell off. So we had to pull over to the side of the road. Luckily, it was just a pin that fell off. So we pinned it back in, drove back to the bar. And then at this time, um, it's kind of like Edna's with the dollar bills inside Bob Marley's. Yeah. But they put up t-shirts instead of dollar bills. So we start talking to the bartender. We buy Sky an old t-shirt to wrap around his head so he doesn't get sunburned. Um, but he's half Persian. So at this point, he looks like a terrorist walking on the beach. <laughs> <laughs> and, um, anyways, we get back. We do that. We get down at the bar. We go home. Um, we get back on the ferry, turn in the car. Everything ended up working out. And it was just a great day. And it's always nice to. Uh, I guess make good memories with good friends, things you'll never forget.